Jesus be. For Jesus paid it all. Oh, to Him I owe. Sin has left the crimson stain. He washed it white as snow. When he was in his garden of Gethsemane, Amen. praying for you, praying for me. Yes. When Amen. Roman soldiers came and took him away, and they took him to the judgment hall of Pilate, and they questioned him about all the good that he did when he was alive. What did Jesus do to deserve to be in judgment? Nothing. He healed the sick. He brought sight to the blind. He fed the hungry, much like we did here today. Amen. What did he do to deserve such scrutiny? But he stood there and he took it. Yes, he and did. And I, I recall a part of the story where Pilate says to him, Don't you know I have the power Go to ahead. keep them from crucifying you? Don't you know I have the power to save your life? And you know what Jesus said to him? You have no power, no power. except giving to Go you by God. And ladies and gentlemen, there's nothing that can touch you unless God allows. Amen. As the story continues, they went out and the people said, crucify him, crucify him. Because he as a man made himself to be God. But he was God. Jesus was fully man and fully God. Amen. That's the mystery of Jesus. Hallelujah. Go ahead, tell the but truth. But still, fully God, he laid down his life. Tell him about I'm told that if Jesus wanted to, he could have called down a thousand angels Amen. to wipe out everybody. That's right. You think about the superheroes in the movies that you see who can wipe out a billion soldiers. Well, Jesus and his host of angels could have wiped everybody out That's who right. was attempting to take him to the cross. But he willingly gave his life for you and me. The story goes on. That to make an example out of Jesus, they took him and with the scourge of cattails, it's a, a rock with arms on it, they beat Jesus. They beat him until you can see the bones in his back.